Hey everyone, hope everybody enjoyed their Memorial Day, especially to all the veterans or all the men and women who are serving who, and who have served. Hope you guys are all enjoying your Memorial Day and uh, wherever you guys are, if you guys are overseas, still out there, please be safe. Our prayers are with you and God bless. Okay, so now... Um, I know it's been a while since I did a video. I've been super busy. Uh, had a lot of family things going on. Um, so this will be my first video in a while. Um, a lot of people have been asking me how I get the lightsaber sounds on my S and on my uh, Note 4. You could actually get different sounds. I just prefer the lightsaber sounds because, you know, a pen is mightier than a sword or, well, anyways. So we're going to go into my phone. I'm going to log in with my fingerprint. Now, first things first, your, uh, let me turn off my volume. Your phone has to be rooted. If it is not rooted, then you won't be able to do this. Um, if you guys want to know how to root your phone, I'm sure you could look up any videos there's some pretty good videos out there on YouTube on how to root your note 4 and then that's it you don't have to have a custom ROM your phone just has to be rooted and you also need a root explorer I have a root file explorer I have root explorer right here and this method works whether you're on lollipop or you're on um, um KitKat. Anyways, I just want to show you guys what version I'm on. This is a, I just did a fresh installation of a new ROM, or it's not new, but it's a new version of a ROM that I've been interested in putting on my phone, and this one is called Infamous ROM, and this is a Dark Note. There's a dark and a light version of this ROM. So see, there's, there's the, uh, when I go to About Device, there's the uh, ROM name, infamous ROM Note 4 based off of Verizon's um, latest firmware which is baseband COD6. Is it focusing? I don't know if it's focusing. Right there. See Android version 5.0.1. So let's get out of there. And we're going to show you how to do it. Now, I just uh, put in the... Uh, the attach sound I think so I'm gonna put in the detach sound for the for the um for the S pen the lightsaber sound so I'm gonna go to root explorer right here and once I get to root explorer I am going to go to my uh, external SD card by going into storage right there now you could have yours saved anywhere, like emulated, extension, SD card, SD card. Mine is on my micro SD card. So it'll be under, for me, it'll, I saved it under extension SD card. So I'm going to go to extension SD card. I'm going to go to my backup folder right here. And then I'm going to scroll down to where it says, um, see I saved my S Pen sounds. So you might want to back up your other um, S Pen sounds just in case you want you want those back so the two files are going to look like this they're identical regardless if it's um, the stock or the lightsaber it doesn't say like lightsaber pen sound or anything like that these that the I think they have to be called um, a certain file name so the file name like I said, I just put in this one, the top one, which is pen um, underscore att dash no t one dot ogg. So I'm gonna put the pen underscore detach or det underscore n o t i one dot ogg. So let's cop. I, I don't even uh, I'm not even gonna copy and paste. Or I'm sorry, I'm not even going to cut and paste. I'll just copy and paste it. So I always have these files around as a backup. 
so I copied it so now it'll say copy here or wherever else right so I'm gonna go back to the root folder so right there I'm back on root and under root I'm gonna go to system from system I'm going to look for the media folder so there's media and under the media folder as you can see I'm gonna look go under audio under audio you have alarms notification pen sounds ringtones and then UI you're going to go to UI not pen sounds but UI so hit UI and then right there I'm gonna copy so it says the current file system is read only do you want to remount as read and write and continue the operation I'm gonna say yes and then it'll say pen detach no t1.ogg already exists do you want to overwrite it I'm gonna say yes and there you go now it's overwritten so now here's the sounds let's see okay what's going on oh Ah, I silenced the phone because remember I got a notification so okay now the sounds back on so there's detached sound and there's attached detach attach so you know what would have been even cooler is once you pull the S pen out and then you start swinging it around it still makes that noise anyways it doesn't so that's it um that's how you put the or how you can put any kind of sound well any kind of sound that is on xda forums anyways mine is the lightsaber s pen sounds i'll put a link in the description and uh as well as uh probably um put the instructions down also on how to on how to um, put the S Pen sounds in. So that's it for the for how do you, how I put in my S Pen sounds. Anyways, all thank you all for watching. Um, and hope you all enjoyed your Memorial Day, and um, I'll see you guys again soon. Take care.